Have you ever wondered why we can't just zip across the universe in a blink of an eye? Well, it all boils down to one thing, the universal speed limit, also known as the speed of light. You see, according to Einstein's theory of relativity, nothing can travel faster than light. That's right, nothing, not even the most advanced spaceship. This cosmic speed limit is about 186,000 miles per second, or roughly seven times around the Earth, in a single second. Now imagine the vastness of space, it's incredibly, mind-bogglingly huge. Even at the speed of light it would take us four years to reach the nearest star to us, Proxima Centauri. This speed limit is a fundamental law of the universe and it imposes serious constraints on space travel. So, if we can't break this speed limit, how can we hope to explore the stars? Enter the concept of warp drive, a theoretical method of faster-than-light travel. Now I know that sounds like something out of a science fiction novel, but bear with me. It's actually grounded in some very real physics. To understand warp drive, imagine space as a fabric. This fabric isn't a flat sheet, it can be bent, stretched, and manipulated. Picture a spacecraft sitting on this fabric. Instead of the ship moving across space with warp drive, we're talking about moving space itself. Here's how it works. Warp drive creates a bubble of normal space around a spacecraft. This bubble is then hitched to a wave of space-time that is expanded behind the ship and contracted in front of it. Picture a surfer riding a wave. The surfer isn't paddling forward, the wave carries them along. Similarly, the spacecraft doesn't move, space does. Imagine you could scrunch up a rug, then step over the folds to reach the other side. That's what warp drive does with space. It contracts the space in front of the ship, effectively scrunching up the fabric of space. At the same time, it expands the space behind the ship, stretching the fabric back out. The result? The bubble and the spacecraft within it are transported faster than light across the universe. But remember, it's not the spacecraft that's moving faster than light, it's the space that's being manipulated. This is a clever workaround to the universal speed limit, known as the speed of light. By bending and stretching space, warp drive allows us to effectively jump across vast distances in the blink of an eye. Now I must clarify that this is all theoretical. We don't have a warp drive engine sitting in a lab somewhere, but the physics behind it is sound, and it gives us a tantalizing glimpse into the potential future of space travel. In essence, warp drive allows us to cheat the universal speed limit. It sounds like science fiction, doesn't it? But could warp drive be a scientific fact? As we venture deeper into the 21st century, the notion of warp drive continues to tantalize scientists and space enthusiasts alike. Currently, it remains a theoretical concept, a celestial carrot dangling just out of reach. But don't be fooled, this is no mere flight of fancy. Serious scientific work is being conducted to study the feasibility of this faster-than-light travel method. Researchers across the globe are grappling with the complexities of warp drive, including the need for negative energy, a concept not yet fully understood. This enigmatic energy is thought to be the key to bending space-time, the crux of warp drive theory. But as we all know, science loves a challenge. The journey to warp drive is fraught with riddles and enigmas, but the pursuit of knowledge is relentless. The stars might seem far away, but who knows? With warp drive, we might be closer than we think. So, what have we learned today about warp drive and space travel? We've journeyed through the cosmos of knowledge, starting with the speed of light limit. We've discovered that this cosmic speed limit, a staggering 186,000 miles per second, is one of the most fundamental laws in the universe. It's what keeps our cosmic ambitions in check. Then, we ventured into the fascinating concept of warp drive. This theoretical mode of propulsion would allow us to bend the rules of space and time, enabling faster-than-light travel without violating the cosmic speed limit. It's like a loophole in the universe's rulebook, a way to cheat the system. We also delved into the current state of warp drive research. While it remains theoretical, exciting advancements are being made, inching us closer to making this science fiction dream a reality. While we have yet to conquer the vastness of space, with concepts like warp drive, the future of space travel certainly looks exciting.